What's up guys, it's MD Peter Fishing here with Kaysen and Luke. And um, we're in Edgemere, Maryland right now, Chesapeake Bay, fishing in Green Hill Cove. And uh, since this is our first video, we're just gonna be showing you guys what we do and what we can catch. So um, we're gonna head to our local bait and tackle so we can get some supplies. We're back from the bait shop and we just got some simple things that we always use. So first we got some of these black barrel swivels to tie on. We got some circle hooks, some slide sinkers because they really work a lot. We got some 30 pound leader line, some bells that go for our bottom fishing. We got a bobber because sometimes this is how we catch perch and it's very effective. And we got a bucktail because why not? And uh, yep, that's all, that's all we're using right here. A little beetle spin with a black barrel swivel clipped. And um, it's been working really good. Man. It's been working really good for us. So I'm gonna go over this way and just start chucking a beetle spin around and hoping that we can get a fish. First cast. You really just don't need to jig it at all. You just need to, you know, do anything. So I'll see you guys once we get some action. Yep. You see him dragging it around? Mm -hmm. Once he takes that thing under, you oh. Yep, is that a fish? Mm -hmm. Ooh, mm. little white perch. All right, first fish of the day. Little white perch, he's going in the crab trap. He's skinny. Really? He's skinny. Chill, 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 chill. Nice little white perch to start the day. He's going in the crab trap. So. He's a little guy. He's, he, he's a little guy. Got a little perch, guys. Yeah. He's gonna go in a bucket so that we can put him in the crab trap. All right, so I got my cast net right here. It's nothing big, it's just a four foot, four foot light cast net. And we're gonna, this is how we get our minnows. Here, like that, grab that. Throw it. Yank it. Let's see if we get anything. Nothing. You know, you don't always get stuff with this. But yeah, I'm gonna keep on throwing this until we get something. Luke right here has got the big rods, big bottom fishing rods. Oh, I got something. Oh, is that a croaker? Mm -hmm. Oh, let's go croaker. Huh. So what crab trap did you put the, the one in? Huh? I didn't put it in, I put it in a bucket. Okay. Yeah, bucket. Cool. Okay. All right, so we got our big bottom fishing rods set up here. We have cut up peeler over there. And we have a croaker in there. That's a good hook on the peeler. Send that boy out there. Perfect cast. That's all you need. That's all you need. Just a little cast. Give it some slack. Let it sink to the bottom. Reel in your slack. Until it's tight, you can see the rod bending. And that's all you need. And we can't forget the bells. Let me see one bell. Right, just pick these up on our local bait and tackle. You, you guys know. So um, we're going to put them on. And we're going to see you guys once we get a hit. 
Um, what's up guys? It's the next day. Um, we did not get any bites yesterday other than that one little perch. So yesterday kind of sucked, but we're back at it again. And we're um, hoping to get a monster fish on the big rods today. So let's set them up. First, we got to start by lifting up the crab traps because they are just good. Oh, our bait's going in that one. We'll lift this one up. All right. Let's oh, check over here. Oh, a little heavy today. Nothing. Our bait's still in there. All right. Well, we forgot to check the minnow trap. See if we get anything in there. Oh, silver side. Oh, some silver side. Ooh. Well, we're gonna throw the cast net out there. Hopefully, get some minnows and um, put the big rods out there. So that hopefully we can get like a monster catfish, rockfish, anything really could be out there. We're so. We're All right, so guys, right now I'm gonna throw this cast net. About a four foot cast net, and we'll try to get anything. And by the way, comment down what is your biggest fish. He's actually a decent sizer. Nice fish. Very Probably nice. about an eight inch right now. Eight inch. Yep. Putting him in the crab trap. Um, very good kid. I uh, got another bottom fishing rod right here. We're gonna set him up with the silver side. This is the setup we're using. Uh, just a treble right here down to a one ounce triangle weight over down here to about 18 inches of 30 pound leader down to a hook not a circle hook and then we're just using the silver side for bait okay all you do is, hook is really hook them through the back and then that's how you hook them all right guys so this is our first big rod this is the one that we catch the most fish on probably because of the spot very simple very simple setup. We just have a treble tied on right here. Goes down to a uh, two ounce weight over to a seven alt circle hook. And um, I'm going to take this frozen croaker that we caught yesterday. And um, all you want to do is hook them right through their nostril. They have a lot of cartilage there, and it's going to stay on there perfectly. And that's just all that's all you do and then you just want to cast it out guys we just had another hit on this orange rod it's crazy we just got another hit on this green on the green rod i don't know if it's going to come back for it don't know we're not we don't know if it's going to come back for it uh we just had one on it we didn't have one we just had a hit on it uh just got another hit we, we just actually just casted this rod out at least five minutes ago. Do you feel any other hits? Yeah, just, just one right now. Right now? Guys, we just got a hit. Um, like, really good hit. And Hopefully he comes back for the bait. Feel any hits? No. Guys, uh, he, has, he has one. We have one. A huge monster on. So, Kaden has a huge monster on. I'm gonna reel in the yellow rod. This right, guys, we just caught this catfish. Now we're gonna get the video. Let's see, let's see, let's see. One of our actually. Good, good release. Good job. Right. We just caught another one back to back. This releasing. Nice let's, channel catfish. Let's release it. That's about like 23 inches. Not bad. Let's get a healthy release on him. Healthy release. Oh, there he goes. And then he's gone. You can see the bubble chair wherever he goes. He's right there still. Cool. There, there he goes. There he goes. All right, guys. So that is going to wrap up our first ever YouTube video. Before we b before we fully end it off, we got to check the crab traps one more time. Yeah, you already know. You have to. I'm sorry. All right, we got the big one right here. Oh, nothing. Nothing in there. We'll move that out for the day. And then, and then walking over here to the other little small one. Guys, you know it'd be great to end it off with a crab trap for you guys, but nothing. Yeah, nothing. Oh, we'll drop this one back down. Oh, uh, all right, come on. And, and right, now the real outro. Well, thank you guys for watching our first ever YouTube video. Hope you guys enjoyed and uh, seen our catch that we got. And um, we'll see you guys in our next video.